just yeah, I'm just picturing it. I'm picturing it. Let's do well, the baby. I'll send you pictures and then you can pick one. Okay. I'll send you pictures of the, I'll send you pictures of the thread, uh, the the cord that we have, and then you can just pick one. Right on, right on. Okay. Awesome. I'm, yeah, I'm excited, dude. All right, all right. Well, all right. we're, we're yeah. gonna be getting started on it right now, so. Right on, brother. Appreciate it, man. And then uh, yeah, just let me know anything else. Uh, yeah, and I'll shoot it back to you once I see it, and then uh, I'll plan on seeing you guys next Saturday. All right, sounds good. Cool, cool. All right, later. All right, bye. Sweet. Got some details. Well, that's called, this leather that we're cutting is called vegetable tan leather. And this one, this, these particular rolls are sourced from Italy. Done. Cool. All right, so what I'm gonna do here, so I'm just gonna start cutting up the, the uh, pieces I need with our dies that we had made. We, used to, we uh, started off with just hand cutting every single piece um, and there was a lot of variances that way, you know. Um, sometimes our templates would start to break down from multiple use and this just helps, you know, keeps things a little bit more accurate. You know when it's gone through, it'll make like a popping noise. There's the pop. That means it's done. <laughs> Ding! Okay, so the next part is, now I'm gonna cut out all my interior pieces from our two three ounce leather that we have. This interior leather is from England. The tannins they use in this leather is a lot different than like say Italy or you know, different places use different things, but the vegetable tan leather, um, the tannins that they use and the reason why they call it vegetable tan is because the leather color comes from vegetables, like potatoes. Originally it was just potatoes. And then um, different countries use different things. So Brazil uses tree bark for the most part, or certain types of yucca plants, or um, different types of potatoes, like a sweet potato. So when you see those super brown sweet potatoes, they use the, the color of the skins. They smash those and press them, and that becomes the tannins for vegetable tan leather. The English leather, however, they use teas and coffee grinds to get use the tannins and that's why this has got this really beautiful kind of like mellow mellow mocha color. And when it's burnished, so when I actually cut or tool any of this type of leather, the, the burnishing effect or the discoloration, that's the tannins being activated. Um, it's really, really dark, very rich color. 